rational rows log window. Now, what is the purpose of this log window? As we work on our rows model, certain information will be posted to the log window. For example, when you generate code, any errors that are generated are posted in the log window. So, whenever you generate some code, then always we go for a cross check whether any error has got registered in the log window or not. If there is no error, that means my diagram is up to this level is correct and will be working perfectly well. And you know that we are having multiple different UML diagrams. So, these UML diagrams are not isolated, they are actually integrated. So, whenever we are having one option that is a check model, when you will be clicking on the check model, it will tell whether these diagrams are commensurating with each other or not, whether these diagrams are corresponding to each other or not. So, if there is some errors, if there is some flaw in our diagram, so then obviously the errors will get registered on this log window. So, that is why this log, win log window is having a very serious purpose in our software development process while drawing the UML diagrams. So, here is one layout. So, need not to read the respective code here, only to give you the idea that how the log window will get populated with different error messages. You can find that different error messages are there. Not only message, it will also give you some guideful information so that you can get the idea that which has to be resolved, which is to be updated so that the error will be removed from here. And as it is a log window, so it will also log in the respective time that when this error has got produced, has got obtained here. So, in this way, this log window is playing a very wider role while making the UML diagrams for the software development process. Thanks for watching this.